Okay, hello friends, Yossi here. Today we're going to talk about the junction, specifically about Toronto's junction top five condos for sale. I'm recording this video at the end of 2018, so this video is relevant for 2018, 2019, 2020. The junction in Toronto, look here, we are at Keele Street looking north, Keel and Dundas, and it really starts around here and it goes uh, northwest on Dundas, north on Keel, and covers a large area that is called uh, the junction. And Google Map will tell you there's junction here and another piece of junction over there. There's two areas defined as junction triangle here and a junction. And we're going to relate to both. But the center of this area is right here. It uh, starts at uh, Bloor and Dundas where the GO train, the TTC, and the UP train, the ones that goes to Pearson Airport. Uh, and then here, it's uh, Dundas, Dupont, Keele area, which is another uh, commercial center. And then the junction continues along Dundas uh, through Annette and up here to St. Clair. Lots of developments available. So let's jump right into it and see which condos I selected for my top five junction condos for the, for the time. All right, so this is the article. And here's a lovely map of the junction that I found online from 1910. Uh, and why is it the junction? Because the railway uh, is all meeting here and obviously in the north, the yellow, these are the stockyards uh, now becoming residential areas. And the entire area is really developing really quickly. It's a good area, it's well connected, you got rail connection, you got uh, street connection, you can drive anywhere you like, you can walk, there's lots of shopping, it's a family area, it's quite safe, you know, the depot, uh, Canadian Tire, all the big box stores are there, but there's also a lot of really small and unique artisan-like shops, which I personally really like. Okay, for my first, first, uh, ta -ta 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 drum roll, the Junction House wins top one for top five Junction condos available for sale in Toronto. Why? Because the Junction House is a gorgeous, gorgeous design, and to me, it really answers the three L's of livability, longevity, and likability, okay? The Junction House hosts only 144 units. It's nine stories tall, and it's really well designed. I really like it because it offers good living. The lobby serves as a co-working space. It's got, it's got a public uh, rooftop area, and it's a very nice place to live, in my opinion. I also think this will sell out very quickly. On November 22nd, we're holding the VIP sale. If you're interested in this project, uh, call me or sign up online at urbanreallytoronto.com and I'll send you the info. There are not going to be any plans or floor prices until 22nd and after we will have them obviously by the 22nd some units I think many will sell out. For more information go to the article uh, on the Junction House and my top five article and you'll see here. Okay so that was Junction House and the page for Junction House is here and you can see the registration form, the address, the floors, the units uh, you'll find some discrepancies, but they'll settle once the project is launched because they're probably still moving around the designs a bit. Uh, usually developers will do it till the very last minute. Okay, here's the beautiful rooftop that is uh, rendered, uh, typical penthouse. Uh, this is the lounge party room, multi-purpose room. I really love it, kind of a library. That, that's a proper living. You know, where so many of us now work from home, either for ourselves or for another company. We need a good place to work. And it's very, very important that we have a place to do that. So there you go. Um, here's, here's a side cut, side view of a unit. Really well. I'm really into that design that gives you longevity as a resident, as an owner, as an investor, and as a tenant. Here's another example of what a room is going to look like. The gym slash yoga. Nice designer. Bath. Uh, some cut from the air. And so on. Okay, so this is the junction. Uh, moving to my number two is Scout Condos. Why Scout Condos? Okay, first of all, Scout Condo has very good amenity. The score is very, very high on livability, longevity, and likability. Okay, the second is the prices are very, very good. Uh, this is a larger. This is a larger project. Um, it offers more units, about 300 here, and I really like the design. I think this will be a very good investor project. It is selling really well. We still have units in the VIP. And if you listen to this video or watching this video after the VIP, 
and you still like to buy a unit here or to assign a unit you already have, simply fill in the contact form on the page for the junction, uh, sorry, for Scout Condo or just a regular uh, contact form, and I'll get in touch with you and see what's available, okay? So that is uh, this. Uh, next, we move into Symington. 386 Symington, and there's a new project. I haven't posted any, any uh, information on it. It is two towers and townhouses. Symington is a great area to be. It's a good street. It's the heart of the junction. And because everything around here is very low, mostly uh, uh, just single family residential homes, you probably get very, very good views here. So there's an added bonus. I like that. Okay. Four is the East Junction. I've made a video about the East Junction. There it is. And you can see the page for East Junction here. I have a dedicated page with a lot of information. And that's also around the area. 394 Simington. Very close. Okay. And this area also offers very high livability, and I like the, the amenities design. It clearly shows that pe people, developers, architects, designers that come into the junction area are paying good attention to what people need to live. <laughs> Isn't that great? I love it. Because a good condo is a place that you can stay there for many, many years. Either you, you live there as an owner or as a tenant. Okay? That is why I'm very, very careful picking units because when you pick a good condo unit for investment or to live, you got to make sure the livability scores very, very high. I will never, ever buy or invest in a unit that just doesn't make any sense because nobody's going to want to live in there and the person who's going to get squeezed in there is not going to pay you full price to live there as a tenant or to buy from you when you're about to flip it to sell it. Okay? Um, back to our list. Number five, Arch Loft. Isn't this beautiful? So this is a, a, a church and a conversion uh, made together. The developer, of course, this is not a Terion project. This is a developer project. I really love it. There's some units left in here from developer that I can let you know about. They are large, expensive units. And there are some smaller units that will be available as assignment and resale. So if you'd like to look at this beautiful development in old church, I think it's got a really good vibe and I really like what they're doing with it. Give me a shout and I'll give you more information about it. So this is um, the top, my top five junction condos in Toronto. There are more projects coming, okay, and I will post them. Um, most of the information I post to my mailing list, uh, which you can sign right here. Um, just go to the investors newsletter. My internet is not connected right now at the coffee shop, so we'll go back here. And once you sign to the newsletter, you will be getting this information that I'm not allowed to post uh, publicly. What kind of information is that? Uh, private VIPs, fam friends and family sales, assignments, anything that I can't really post online. Okay, so remember, when you buy a condo, you can, if it's posted online, it's one thing. If it's not posted online and and and, um, and you can get to it, yeah, like from a newsletter that I have or other sources, this is good because you may find deals that you could not find elsewhere. And that means that if you can find that deal, you can probably get a better price. If you get a better price, you can probably get a better ROI. Okay, you get it. So this is it. Uh, you're also signing out for now. I hope this was a, a good video. Please leave me in the comments your ideas, your questions, your suggestions. What are your top five condos for the junction? Where would you buy? Okay, so that's it. Remember, uh, the 22nd of November will be the Junction House VIP sale. Don't miss on that. If you're looking in the junction, look right here. Give me a shout and I will get you into that sale. That's it. Yossi out. Take care.